Final race on the flat already then. Mile and three quarters for four year olds and upwards. Chariot Charger on its cherry. No more promises. D. Hooley, Harrow on the Hill, Darren Thompson, Hector Eclipse, David Robson, Mahab Funshine, Derek Hinton, Acorn Street. Craig Allen, starting trucker Holly Peacock, Lord Whiteford, Jim Murray, Prince B, Kevin Meenahan, Mr Yates, Paul Rhodes, San Antonio, Peachy, Vinnie Gerrard, Red Ruth Sky, Craig Allen, the special mix, Joshua Sutherland, Horst, Do D. Tromine, for Leon van Rensburg, Huntress, Martin Leland, Bala Per May, for Michael Scala, Transfic Turk, Ryan Costello, American Woman, Ryan Tamasivi, and Sin Script for Graham Clutterbuck. They're all in, and... Ready to go, and off they go, and I'm pretty sure Sinscript was Graham Clutterbuck's champion horse from last season, so let's see how that one goes, if it's the same one. So it's in the lead already, and if it is, and it's Chariot Charger that's going to come through to challenge it, they'll have just the one turn to take, and they're about to take it shortly, but it's Chariot Charger who's in the lead from Sinscript in front, in, in second, sorry, then Lord Whiteford and Hector Eclipses after that one. Uh, then no more promises and Prince B looking towards the back. Horse Dudi Tromine and Transfixed Turk are towards the back. The Grey Huntress is also nearer the back than the front. But Chariot Charger is in front as they get to this one turn. Then and Chariot Charger in front from Sin Script in second. Gap off three lengths then back to Hector Eclipse and Prince B and Lord Whiteford. Starting truck is trapped in on the inside by no more promises. Acorn Street is also there. A little bit of a gap then to Mr Yates. Barla Per May is also there as well. Horse Dude Tromine is making a bit of ground as well. So too is American Woman. And Huntress is the one widest on the track. The grey and the purple and white stripes. The back marker is Mahab Funshine. But it's Chariot Charger who's charging his way home at the moment. And he's about a length clear of Sin Script in second. Gap of three to Hecton Eclipse and Prince B. Then starting Trucker and Red Ruth Sky. Lord Whiteford is after that one. And Acorn Street and Misty Yates. San Antonio Peachy trying to make a forward move. So too is Harrow on the here an American woman horse de Tromine is nearer the back than the front Huntress is virtually last now Mahab Funshine has been pulled up but it's Chariot Charger in the lead from Sin Script in second then Hecton Eclipse is third Red Ruth Sky Prince B and starting truck is still there as well so no more promises and it's Chariot Charger in front. Sin Script is in second. Bit of a gap then to Prince B, who's going to need a bit of a split being held in by Hexon Eclipse. Then after that one comes Red Roof Sky. No more promises and starting trucker after that one. Then Horse Dern by Tromine and San Antonio Fiji. Balaper Maze after that one. And then American Woman and Lord Whiteford. But it's Chariot Charger who's in front. Sin Script has hit a flat spot. Hexon Eclipse is trying to come through to challenge. They've still got four furlongs to go. And Chariot Charger is in the lead by a length to Hexon Eclipse in second. And then Prince B, the one bursting through there is no more promises. Horse Dude Tromine is also going well, so is Red Ruth Sky, and also Acorn Street is also coming through. Acorn Street coming through to challenge, but it's still Chariot Charger in the lead. Chariot Charger from Acorn Street, and now Acorn Street up the centre of the track is probably just in front. Acorn Street in the lead from Chariot Charger, Hecton Eclipse. Here comes the special mix. American Woman's trying to get into it as well, but it's Acorn Street who's gone for home. Acorn Street in the lead, four and a half to go, two lengths clear of the special mix in second, Hecton Eclipse American Woman is still trying to finish well but it's Acorn Street, he's clear, Acorn Street clear by two, Acorn Street in front the special mix is trying to close but it looks like Acorn Street might have enough, here comes the special mix, how special is this mix, it's not going to get there, it's Acorn Street special mix and Hecton Eclipse has got up to take it on the line I think well it all changed in the final half furlong and Hecton Eclipse might well have just eclipsed them all it's Acorn Street has hit the wall in the final few yards and American Woman's finished like a train as well so Hecton Eclipse takes it for David Robertson Acorn Street second for Craig Allen American Woman third for Ryan Tamasibi who might be a guess who fan and finishing fourth was if the card comes back I think it was, was it special mix for Joshua Sutherland might have been fourth Indeed it was, and Horst Dudy Tromine for Leon van Rensburg, which hopefully won't make his league team, was fifth.